rich in the canting language, the criminal slang of its day. Pop quiz. Someone asks you your name. How do you respond? Do you A, say your name, or B, say, go send the payment? Question two. Someone asks for clarification on instructions you've given them. Do you A, clarify your instructions, or B, say, have you sent the payment? If your answer to either of these was B, have I got a job for you? Now, this particular scammer today cold called me pretending to be from Bank of America and had the nerve to get mad when I didn't immediately understand his haphazard grumblings after 30 seconds. Have scammers forgotten the lost art of conversation? Or did they ever know it in the first place? Let's ruin this guy's day, shall we? Hello? Yeah, how are you, Sam? Good, who's this? Okay, we have been calling you from um, Bank of America. Oh, okay, yes, yes. Well, yeah, this is um, the authority that is holding the... Oh, the authority, phone yes. For you. You have to pay, you have to pay. You have to pay for the insurance and the motivation fee so that um, the ATM card, you can be able to withdraw from the, the what fee? TV. The activation fee of the ATM card because, um, oh, our of course, yes, our, our tellers department have already credited your phone into ATM card. They've so already turned my phone into an ATM card. That's some new technology. I don't know. I don't have a NFC on or any of that kind of thing, so. Hello? Hello? Yeah, what do you want? This is Clint Runaround here. I've been trying to reach you. Are you still at the Bank of America there, sir? Yeah, what is the problem? What happened? Uh, I don't know. You weren't answering the calls. I have given you information to send the money. To send the money send yeah, the but money. you weren't answering the calls, so I don't know what was. I don't know if what the problem was there, sir. You know. You are a very very stupid man, idiot. Uh, what was that, sir? Yes. Uh, we got cut off there. This is Clint Runround. <laughs> I don't know what. The are you out of your mind? I don't know what the problem is with your phone there, sir. Are you out of your mind? Uh, no, I haven't left yet. But you you told me to go to Bank of America. Now you're telling me to go somewhere else, so I'm not sure. You got my message? Yeah, I got your message, but I don't routinely read text. You know, that's why I said to be on the phone. Kind of a please be online kind of, of an initiative, you know? Go and use it. Go and use it for next time. Come out. Oh, well, you're gonna have to settle down there, sir. Go to Western Union store and send the money for your own good. No, I'm not going to the store. I'm going to Bank of America. Hello. Uh, hello. This is Clint Runaround. Uh, can you hear me now? Yeah, have you sent the money? Can you hear me now, there, sir? Yes, I'll be sending the money. Oh, great. Um, are you still at, uh, you were at Bank of America, I believe you were saying, yesterday, sir? Yes, I sent you the information. Um, you already sent me that, didn't you? Or I'm so mixed up these days, you know. Here I got Mr. Raymond floating around one day, you the next. I mean, where does it all end, you know? Go to Western Union store and uh -huh. send the money. Western Union store, what's that? If you don't know what Western Union, that is, you're you a stupid man. Uh, excuse me, sir? You're a stupid man. If you don't know what is Western Union, I'm a what, what does that have to do with the bank, though, or the ATM cards? What? Did you just call me a scallywag? Uh, hello? What can I do for you? Yes, we keep getting cut off. Is that uh, because of you, or is that something I'm doing on my side? But, uh, you are saying rubbish. Rubbish, yes. I've heard that word many, many times before, and you know, I just don't appreciate it, actually. I'm just trying to get to the bottom of this ATM card. W what am I getting in return again? Didn't you cold call me? Right? No, my name is
sir. No, no, none of that. None of that. Um, what am I getting in return again? Hello. Hello. How are you? Good. Is this Mr. Cold Call here? This is. How are you? I'm good. Who is? Is this Mr. Cold Call here? This is Clint Runaround here again. Have you sent the money? Oh, you're not even gonna acknowledge my hello. Okay, that's great. Um, the money. Hello. Hi, is this Mr. Cold Call here? Yes. Oh, great. This is a uh, Clint Runaround calling back. Okay. Uh, you told me to get an iTunes. You told me to get an iTunes yes. card. Uh, I have plenty. Yes. Yeah, I already have plenty of music, sir. I don't think I need to be getting any of those. Because my iTunes card crashed. No, I don't. I don't need any more music, sir. I already have plenty, like I just said. I am the person that needs iTunes card. Not you. Not you. Why? Why do you need more music? I thought. I, I thought we were trying to send money. I don't know why you need to be downloading stuff. I need it. I need this for my chest. I'm buying it from you. What, what do you need? I'm what do you listen to, to, sir? iTunes card. You listen to iTunes card? Uh, hello? 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 Is yes. this... Is this, is this Mr. Cold Call here? Yes. Have you bought oh, the great. ITunes this card? is Clint Runround again here. Yes. Have you bought the iTunes card? Uh, in the last 45 seconds since we spoke? Yeah. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Because that's how long it takes to go to the store and get one of those, right? Okay, go to the store and get one, okay? Yeah, but what? why do you need that again? You're What are you downloading? Yeah, I want to buy some of them. Can you speak up, sir? You want to frame it? You want to frame it as kind of a memento of our conversations? Yeah, but what are you going to do with it in your office? Yes, I know. You've said that about 400 times. Um, but um, like I said, I need to know what you're going to be doing with the card. Hello? Hi, is this uh, Mr. Cold Call here? Yeah, for talking. Oh, great. This is Clint Runaround again. We were just speaking. Uh, we seem to get cut off a lot. That's might have something to do with the DAW or something, right? But um, you were talking about you were talking about the novels, correct? Um, I just didn't know if you had downloaded any of those yet into your DAW of choice. Is it what? You said you were going to download some novels with my iTunes card for some reason. Or download them, yeah. sorry. I don't know what your preferred DAW is of choice. More of an Ableton guy myself, but if you... You know, there's plenty to go around. You know, the logics and the pro tools of the world, and... You know. You are, you are a very lack of understanding man. I'm a very you lack of understanding man? What? Uh, hello? Speaking. Oh, all I said was hello. I didn't ask the question yet. Is this Mr. Cold Call? Here? Yes. Okay, great. That's what I needed here. Uh, this is Clint Runround. Here? Have you sent the money? Oh, that, that, that line. I love that line. Um, uh, What money was that again? Go to store. Go to any store. Go to I, store. I Yes, you do need the iTunes card then, but I don't know which novels you're downloading. Like I said, I have various songs that I could help you with. A stupid Marshall. Well, I haven't ascended to that rank yet. What, sir? Um, oh, the listen to me is yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Just buy iTunes card. Send me the picture. It's okay. Don't bother about anything like Yeah, you already told me that, but I don't know which ones you're going to download, and then I don't know how much to send. And, uh, we don't have to deal with the whole MP3s and, and whatnot, right? What was that, sir?
Yes. Oh, great. Um, I'm trying to reach Mr. Cold Call. Yes. Yes. This is the podcast. Oh, what? Um, yeah. This is Clint Runround, sir. We've been speaking. Uh, we were speaking about the uh, the format that you'd like for the iTunes card, correct? Yes. Uh, you you didn't specify. Yes. Uh, that's not a genre, sir. Yes. Oh, you would like some yes. Okay, uh, Owner of a Lonely Heart, maybe, is a good one we'd like to start out with. Or uh, I know Changes is always a classic. Are you familiar with those? <laughs> uh, uh, hello? Are you available there, sir? Uh, hello? Do you? Sorry, I want to ask you a question. I want to ask you a question. Can you hear me? Uh, yes. This is—is is this Mr. Cold Call though? I've been talking to him. I. Hello. Are you smoking? No, I'm trying to reach Mr. Cold Call. Is that you or someone else? What can I do for you? Hello. Is this Mr. Cold Call here? You are very stupid. Don't ask me that question again. Uh, is this Mr. Cold Call here? Come on, get out. Uh, yeah. This is uh, Clint Runround. I'm trying to reach. Hello? Hello? Is this Mr. Cold Call here? Have you made the payment? Is is this Mr. Cold Call here? Yes, have you sent oh. the money? At long last, I've been able to get you. How are you doing today, sir? I don't like picking your call. Because you, don't... you keep talking, talking, talking. Oh, yes, we're... My... Well, I don't... Quiet! Uh, Have you sent the payment? Yes or no? Oh, uh, yes, sir, okay. You mean? Hello? Hello, is this Mr. Cold Call here? Have you sent the payment? Oh, I asked, is this Mr. Cold Call here? This is uh, Clint Runaround. How many times will you ask me? I say yes. Well, you didn't You didn't say yes. You said, have you sent the payment? That's not really an answer to what your name is, is it? Hello? Hi, is this Mr. Cold Call here? Hello, Monster. Yes. yes, is this Monster Cold Call here? What can I do for you? What can I do for you? Uh, this is you this is Clint Runaround. I'm not sure if you remember me. I just returned from a jaunt in uh, Argentina, listen, actually. Listen. I have told you to send payment. What? What about SMS, sir? To finalize the transaction. Uh, you some have something what about the transaction, Mr. Cold Call. I, not be able to help you again. To me or I, 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 I would you. appreciate your help, Mr. Cold Call. You know, yes. we've been trying to do this for so long now, right? The text now subscriber you are trying to reach phone, is not available. Ass. Please leave your message. At uh, hello? Have you sent the money? Yes or no? Hello? Is this Mr. Cold Call here? Fuck you. Pop quiz. Was this scammer an absolute moron? Yes. Yes, he was. Hopefully, he has a nice iTunes card full of .jpeg.exes in his future. If you enjoyed this journey, please share this video with your local cold call connoisseur, and I'll see you in the warming shack. Cheers.